y'all welcome back to Chris's kitchen so our every plate box just arrived it's actually about four hours earlier than it was last week so maybe the delivery guy knew where he was coming this week I don't know but we are trying a few different things we did four meals last week for four people and we're doing the same thing for this week I'm excited to see how it's different um, as far as pros and cons of last week pros the food all tasted good. Nothing was like nasty. Um, it they were very easy recipes, very easy to follow. Nothing difficult at all. Um, a con is definitely that every meal had like potatoes and carrots, or I mean every meal I think had potatoes except for the linguine, but they all had like potatoes and carrots. And by that last meal. The carrots were like soft bendy, which I've never had. And I've left some carrots in my fridge for like a month. I've never had them that were like soft and like malleable like that. And my pork chops had gone bad. So I had to pull pork chops out of my freezer. Now again, I was at the five day mark. So that's probably a little too long for their stuff. Oh, I have a ton of little stuff on top in here. Um, another pro was they, it was boxed and packaged very well. I loved it. I was able to tear it all down to make 90% of it recyclable as well. And we ate all four meals. Michael said his favorite was the chicken. Um, Eleanor was asking for the chicken again. Also, um, I'm trying to think, Thatcher, he probably liked the chicken the best too. So that's probably everybody's favorite. Michael just absolutely did not like the linguine. He ate it the first time and told me he liked it okay. But then whenever I told him we had some leftovers in the fridge, he was like, I didn't really like that. So, who knows. Um, okay, so this is cool. I have two little free, it says give a friend a free box. So, it says claim within 30 days. Uh, so, this little thing has a code on it. You can get a free box. I don't know how much... Um, if they'll charge you shipping or anything oh no it says the whole box including shipping and everything will be free um so the first two people that comment that they want them these are oh hold on might be the first three people so the first three people that comment they want a free box um let me know and i'll give you the code i'm not going to just post the codes up there because then i mean you'll never know if they've been used or not so First three people, if you want to try a free box from Hello Plate, those are all yours. It says special offers inside, perks from our friends. So let's see what we got. Uh, KiwiCo, which we've looked into KiwiCo before. This says get your first month free. That would be awesome. We love all kinds of crafts and stuff for the kids. Uh, Geico Auto and Home Insurance. Um, no, thank you. I was not just just not for us um we have pretty good home and auto insurance but that's awesome and then a 100 dollars wine voucher from naked wines i think i've looked into this i know i've looked into a wine something before with that and the wine was like outrageously priced so i don't know i'll probably still look into it too just to see what that is but this is awesome cool little partnerships that they have so we'll put that to the side and Oh, we're missing some of our food carts. They're probably down in here. But we have um, just two recipe cards in here so far. The Turkish chicken and rice bowl. So like I said, we're trying something a little bit different. That's not something that we would usually eat. But I love Mediterranean Lebanese food. And that's what that kind of said to me. This kind of looked similar to that with the fact that it's got tomato cucumber salad and a lemon crema on it. And then crispy Caesar chicken with roasted carrots and garlic mashed potatoes. So their standard of roasted carrots with some fry seasoning and garlic mashed potatoes. Is that what this is? Let's see. I would, well, I guess they are not putting the fry seasoning on the carrots for this one because there's no fry seasoning saying it's included. So uh, let's see. So for the carrots, trim, peel, cut, uh, tossed carrots one side of the baking sheet with large drizzle of olive oil, salt, and pepper. So, just some plain right here. Uh, I'm hoping that somewhere down in this box, though, are the rest of my 
recipe cards. So not on those sides yet, but we will see. Um, let's pull up what my other recipes are then. Because I don't remember. Sorry, y'all. We're going to pull it up. Every place. There we go. Good news is it's like in my history list. It doesn't take, it's not hard to find. So this is the week of July 7th. We got the Turkish chicken and rice bowl card. We got, oh, we're missing the Dijon mushroom pork chop recipe card and the apricot Dijon turkey meatloaves. So I'm guessing the Dijon just made them forget everything. <laughs> but let's see what we got. So we have our mushrooms. That's for our Dijon mushroom pork chops. Some little packs of Caesar dressing. A pack of basmati rice. Turkish spice blend. Looks like a little English cucumber or seedless cucumber. That's probably for that. Another basmati rice. Dried thyme. Tuscan heat spice. So let's put our spices together. Oh, now I'm a little sad they did this different than how they did it the last time with the packaging. Um, because the potatoes are kind of all mixed in here. Whereas last time they had them in that cute little box. It worked out perfect. But... Uh, let's see, panko breadcrumbs, Turkish spice blend. Now I substituted on one of the recipes, maybe this crispy Caesar chicken. Let's see if it tells me. Um, I substituted Brussels sprouts for one of them. Yeah, with that one. Um, one thing I did think about after this had already charged and shipped is maybe next time I'll probably just buy a package of Brussels sprouts or green beans or something. Because they charged me $2 for the upgrade. And you get the Brussels sprouts, but you don't get the carrots also. And I can get a bag of Brussels sprouts for like $3 and then have an extra vegetable. So that's probably what I'll do next time instead of just substituting. Because what's the point of losing something but paying extra? Another pack of Caesar dressing. Some carrots that are nice and firm. Some more carrots, nice and firm. We've got a bunch of sour cream, probably for all of the mashed potatoes. Let's see. Some more panko breadcrumbs, some more parmesan, or some parmesan cheese. Another little cucumber, an onion, a couple things of garlic. Roma tomato, Roma tomato, lemon, and a lemon. Now, also remember, if you're getting a smaller box, mine is probably double the amount of yours because I'm getting the, um, the four person. Like four meals for four people. Sour cream, ponzu sauce. I love ponzu sauce. Every time we go to eat sushi, Thatcher gets these, um, like, um, some more that was some more ponzu sauce and some more cheese but thatcher gets some um like tempura vegetables that come with that and it's so good so we're gonna slide our box out and see what's in the rest of this so we have a couple packets of the chicken um prostitute the consomme stuff a few things of dijon mustard a bunch of potatoes and some bon maman uh, apricot preserve. I love Bon Maman stuff. Oh, that one's not even labeled, but that's what this is. That's in this one. I actually, oh, sorry for the sweet. I actually have some of these same things that I got um, on Christmas. We love these on our biscuits, so I am confident that those will be delicious as well. So that's our potatoes. And then let's see how our proteins look. So this ice pack is still like solid. That's good. Our boneless pork chops. Boneless pork chops. Oh, it's frozen. So you know they were nice and cold. And then that's our chicken breast. Chicken breast strips. And that's boneless skinless chicken breast. Oh, so they may have different... 
And that's just regular chicken breast. And this is strips. And then our ground turkey. And it's got the little absorbent pads in the bottom of them. Let's see. Right, I'm gonna rip all this out just so I can double check that my recipe cards didn't fall down. So nope. All right. So we're missing two of our recipe cards. Bleh. I don't really like that. Make sure they're not. I didn't mix them up in this stuff. Nope. They are legit missing. So thankfully they have the recipes online as well. It's just going to suck to not have them right there next to me. I've been clipping them to the side of the fridge, reading them and referring to them as I go. Um, really, there's no point in them sending them to me because I'm going to be through this by the time they would come in the mail. It just, it's sad that you don't have them right there. I'm going to have to be on an electronic device. I don't really want to be doing that while I've got food stuff in my hand either. But I'm excited for what we've got. So this week, recap, we'll have crispy Caesar chicken with Brussels sprouts and garlic mashed potatoes, apple or apricot Dijon turkey meatloafs with garlic mashed potatoes and roasted carrots, um, Dijon mushroom pork chops with crispy roasted potatoes, and Turkish chicken and rice bowls with tomato, tomato cucumber salad and lemon crema. So if you notice, three out of the four have potatoes and two out of the three were supposed to have carrots. Um, I just wish they had some more variety in that, but overall, they've been good. They're very good for beginner cooks also. You don't need a lot of fancy equipment. You don't need too much of anything. Maybe a boiler pot, a skillet, and a roasting pan. Knife cutting board, like you can really do this in a very small, minimal kitchen. So, we'll test out the recipes. We'll bring y'all along the way and show you what we get and what we think of them. But if you use this or any other subscription, let me know. Um, let me know what you think of them. If you have any comments or you want one of these free boxes, just leave a comment and I'll leave you the code for it. I'll also down below leave the link if you want the $20 off of your first box also with my little coupon code. But if you're a regular to our channel, please remember to subscribe and hit the like button so that you'll get notified each time we post videos. And you'll also get notified when we post these recipe videos. But thank y'all for joining us and we'll see y'all next time. Bye.